Good morning, Voxman Kyle here. I just drinking my coffee and um, watching some beatboxing tutorials, and I noticed that on beatbox humanbeatbox.com they're missing a certain type of scratching that I know how to do. So I thought I'd try to share it with you. Um, essentially, what you do is well, I'll play the sound first. So I don't know, in DJ terms, I don't know what that would be called, some sort of electro scratch maybe or something, because you can't really throw words into it. But it's really good for throwing into a beat and doing hi-hat sort of stuff. So after laboring very hard to figure out actually what I was doing uh, with my tongue, I think I figured it out. So essentially you clench your teeth and put your lips into a... Uh, well, you can put it into different positions, but let's try a tight F sound, like like you're just about to swear. But make sure your teeth are clenched. Then what's going to happen inside of your mouth is your tongue is going to go back and forth, kind of like you're going yo 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 but non-vocalized, so just... However, but you didn't hear any sound there, you know, you just heard. So what you want to do to get, what you want to do is create a seal with your lips that closes off most of your teeth, but is just causing the air to get forced out the center too. So if I do it without closing off those, the rest of my teeth, I get a, just an empty, wet sound. But if I somehow create a seal with my lips against the rest of my teeth, so the air has no choice, but when I do the y sound to get forced through some of the center teeth, I get... It'll probably take some work figuring out how to close off, create a little seal, an airtight seal, but if you figure it out, you can get lots of really cool sounds. So that's the other one. Then you can change the shape of your lips as long as you maintain that seal. You can change the shape of your lips. So if you do a, a kissy face or an ooh face, keeping your teeth clenched and a seal all around there so that the uh, only air is really coming out of those center teeth. And I don't know people with big gaps in their teeth or no gap at all, they might not be able to do this, but it'd be interesting to try and figure it out. Also a little bit of spit in there helps, so if you've got cotton mouth, probably take a sip of your morning coffee. Get it lubed up a bit. So that's really good for, um, on a microphone it's not great unless you've EQ'd it and compressed it and then it gets pretty fat sounding, but uh, it's really good for writing music, you know, just kind of thinking there and like, okay, what do I want this drum beat to be like? <laughs> then maybe later I'd go to my drum set or my synthesizer and actually create the... the Anyway, yeah, if you have any questions, email me, uh, kyle at big-mess.com, 
or check out my uh, my music online where I do a lot of beatboxing in this band. It's big-mess.com. The band's called The Big Mess. Hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. Thanks and good morning.